Do you know which English tense is used to describe actions that were happening at a specific point in the past? I am a little bit of 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 a little The past continuous tense helps us to describe actions that were happening in an ongoing way at a specific point in the past. This tense is a bit like painting a picture of the past with our words. So, how do you make the past continuous tense? Well, it's formed by using the simple past forms of to be and adding. The present participle form of another verb. Present participle form is usually just verb plus ing. So, the simple past of to be plus verb ing. Let's look at some examples. She was reading a book when I called. Here, the action of reading was in progress when something else happened. They were playing football at 3 p.m. yesterday. Here, the action of playing was ongoing at a specific time yesterday, 3 p.m. I was being foolish when I crashed my Arabana. Again, the action of being foolish was happening continuously when the accident happened. Notice that this last example uses the verb to be twice was and being. That's because we use the verb to be to form this tense by putting it together with another verb, even if that other verb is itself to be. So you can say, I was being foolish. Again, to form this tense, you need two main things the past tense forms of the verb to be and a present participle form of a verb, which is just verb plus ing. For the past tense form of I, we use was. For the past tense forms of you, he, she, it, we, they, we use were. Then we add the present participle form of the main verb that we are talking about happening in the past. Again, for most verbs, this just means adding the ing to the end of the verb. So, read becomes reading and be becomes being. Let's practice. Can you turn these sentences into the past continuous tense? One, I study last night. Two, they cook dinner at 6 p.m. Three, I am lazy yesterday. Good work. Here are the answers. One, I was studying last night. Two, They were cooking dinner at 6 p.m. 3. I was being lazy yesterday. Try to practice making some of your own sentences with the past continuous. But while you're practicing, watch out for these common mistakes. First, don't forget to use was or were before the main verb. 2. Be careful with spelling when adding ing to the verb. Three, use the past continuous for actions that were in progress at a specific time in the past, not for actions that were already completed at the time of your story. How Rebarez, if this grammar video was helpful for you, then don't forget to watch the other videos in my playlist so you can practice the other tenses also. Wa agar barasti basud bubet poto. تکایا شیری ام ویدیو بکه لگال هاور کانت ممنونتام هاور برس. Until tomorrow, حتی سبینی خوافیس.